Hey there, good morning. I'm John. Today is Monday, April 8th, 2024. Uh, welcome to another entry in my, uh, my morning stand-up, my daily vlog, <clears throat> where I uh, take this time each morning to report on what I have been doing and what I'm doing next to try to make content creation sustainable in the long term. Uh, so let's start with, uh, we have the full weekend recap here. So uh, I will say that I pretty much took the weekend off. I know the last weekend I talked about how I worked through the weekend-ish, uh, but um, it was very very lazy very recuperative weekend so i uh, had a good time i saw my daughter uh, on saturday we drove down and, and visited but um uh let's talk about friday first so uh friday was the release of the play video uh it was the empire strikes back it's these <clears throat> this series of i said i think i said last week that if these continue to do well then this is definitely a series and it's definitely a series at this point so uh, it was Empire Strikes Back is what the poll had done and so I did a video just playing through what Empire is like and how what you know What's often overlooked about it and just a little bit of kind of history and trivia about it um, so by <clears throat> That released I'm gonna say four in the afternoon or so on Friday by 10 a.m. Saturday morning uh, 10,000 views on that uh, as it stands right now, uh, that video has done 13 and a half thousand views. So a, a further, a further three and a half thousand just since it hit 10. Uh, so the, uh, I keep saying, look, the next one, this one Friday will probably be not as popular, right? Like you can't expect them to all keep building and keep building, right? So eventually there'll be a couple that aren't as good or popular. But I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not hoping for that. I'm just braced for that. I don't want to have the feeling in my, my head or my heart that, oh, this is a free gravy train. Every one of these I do is going to be amazing. It's not how it works. It's just been, we've done a very good run. Um, but look, that video did great. I already, there's a poll out for the next one. I kind of, looks like I see where the front runner is. I'm kind of planning for that unless things change. So another one this Friday. <laughs> I mentioned also last week that I did a bonus one kind of. On Friday, I recorded and edited it. It was very easy, but it was a follow-up to a previous play we had done uh, about Superman. And that one, um, again, very low effort video, just showing some tricks of how you can kind of cheat the game. <clears throat> uh, not as big, but look, 3,500, almost 3,500 views since that posted on Saturday morning. Um, that's a low range video right now. That tells you how good my recent videos have been doing that a 3,500 view video in two days is meh, is you know, toward the bottom of the barrel. <clears throat> you can look on the chart and see that it's uh, kind of mid range. Uh, again, it was a free video, it was an extra video. I call it free because it was so easy to do. I used assets that I already had. Um, also on Friday, so, so yeah, good, good work on Friday and Saturday. So i very happy with that. You know, I put out four long form videos last week. I had to look back and go, really? That Oh, and that one? Yeah, and I'll be damned. Yeah, so. Um, so, also I, I, I did editing on the sponsored video, which I told you about. We had a meeting with them, but they didn't show up. So we have a follow-up meeting coming up later in the week to touch base on that. So that's pushed that off a little bit. I thought this week, maybe next week. Now we'll see. Um, also, then I spent some time at the end of the day kind of stacking this week. Best laid plans though, there's a change, so we'll talk about that in a second. Uh, let's talk about stats. So I have my artificial metric of 10,000 views and 50 subscribers, average over the last seven days. It's kind of just, a, it's a par that I'd like to stay above if I possibly can. Uh, and despite the solid videos, um, uh, it, we had a really weak Sunday, and the good week from last week, of course, rolled off. So. We're at 11,500 uh, 11, views, so just above, and 46 subscribers, just below. So we're still around in the ballpark, but we slipped under in subscribers per day. That being said, uh, we hit another milestone, of course. When we last spoke, it was, we had just hit 47.7, and now we're at 47,845. So almost, what, 150 from 48? What did we say last time? There was a debate, Kat said May the 4th, and then uh, uh, Rick had said, end of May, 20 something. It's starting to look like Cat may be right with only 150 left. And what is this, the, what did I say, the eighth? Oh yeah, <clears throat> well, there's no way we'll, we'll have 48 well before May the 4th at this point. There's no way in the next two weeks we don't do 150 subscribers doing a 50 average. Wow, wow, when did that happen? <clears throat> no, no, 
what were we predicting? I, I, I don't know, we're predicting 50? I can't keep it straight, whatever. Looks like 48, I may be misquoting you, 48,000 probably gonna be end of the week maybe? Yeah, oh, we were predicting 50, weren't we? Yeah, there's my mind, yeah. Welcome to Monday, you know how that works. Let's talk about today, <laughs> goodness. Um, podcast editing prep today. Uh, we have we record it every couple of weeks. We'll record it again this Friday, but we have a, a backtrack to edit tomorrow live. So I'll just kind of you know, lay that out on the timeline and get it ready. Um, I was expecting, I planned for a product review to be the first video of the week, but I'm still waiting on that to arrive. It hasn't arrived. So I'll have to shift some things around and decide the next, next long form video before that, because if it's not here, I can't work on it. You know, it's, I mean, I can, I guess I could do some thumbnailing and stuff, but <clears throat> you need, need to be productive. Uh, so I will do some graphics and research, both for the upcoming Friday play and for whatever I decide to be the next long form video. Um, I need to generate some more shorts. I've been holding off on publishing shorts the last few days. We had so many videos last week. I didn't also dip in with shorts, but those really do well and keep our stats up and our in, in, inbound views and subscribers in. So uh, I'll take another one of those um, tier videos and break them into you know 15, 20 shorts and we'll have another several weeks of them. Uh, so I'll probably do that this week. I don't know if it's today or not. Also, I have a uh, uh, this week's episode of Celebrating Yesteryear I need to lay down. Uh, <clears throat> it's a little bit of on cam and voice recording. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goodness. Um, I need to get that done at some point today, too. So it's a busy day and week, plus recording at the end of the week. Uh, so I... I I want to talk just briefly here at the end about those play videos. <clears throat> we, uh, it's making me, <laughs> it's, I, I always believe in small adjustments, right? I, I kind of drive my life, my career, my hobbies, whatever. I drive it like a big ship in the ocean, right? It's it, you're slow to get up to speed, small adjustments, right? Don't, you know, I'm, I don't do U-turns or loop-de-loops or anything. It's little adjustments, but I'm finding over this last few weeks that those, what I was calling low effort videos, low production investment, are delivering dividends greater than more insightful things. Now, someone might knee jerk react and go, well, there you go, drop all the big research projects and just do these little one off videos that take you, you know, three hours to do. You, I have to remember back to the time when I did the almost exactly these videos and they got no attention. And I think the reason they're doing well now is because I have spent the last year plus building and curating an audience that knows my face and voice and wants to hear what I have to say about these other things. And you earn that, I believe, I, I just who knows, we earn that by showing that you have critical skills and analysis for doing reviews and more in-depth things. You know, it's... So if, if I shifted to just do, I mean, someone might think, just do only those, don't do anything else. I think I need to continue to do both, but there's no denying the, the views and the subscribers and the revenue that comes out of those videos. So I may start doing more of those than the other types, certainly, but it's little adjustments because if those start to fade out and I put all my eggs in that basket, it's hard to get this other thing up to speed again. So I'm having a little bit of a, kind of a, a balancing act crisis inside of my own head where I would love to just do another quick video that gets me, you know, 14, 15,000 views, but I also don't want to squander the, the audience and goodwill that I've built who rely on me to do the more in-depth things as well. It's almost like those are, you know, those are well, the ones paying the, I don't know, I, I'm at a loss for an analogy and I'm kind of an analogy nerd. It's it's like the work is kind of paying the rent and everything. And the other one is like the fun money. It's almost like it's not money, but in terms of goodwill. So I, I'll think of a better analogy after I turn the camera off, I'm sure. My point is, I, I think it's important to continue to do both of those. We'll see as time goes on. Look, we've talked about the fact that just focusing on gaming history was not my intent when I started the channel either. I got there by following trends and seeing what worked. And now, as I'm seeing this other subset of it, is the trend that I'm kind of going to lean toward, but I'm also not going to cut everything off at the knees that I'm also doing. Um, 
in, in the case that I misdiagnosed what's happening or that has a, a smaller shelf life. Um, we'll continue to watch. That's what these are for. These vlogs are about us and analyzing these things and figuring out how best to move forward and looking for the chinks in the armor. You know, what am I not thinking of? Those are all things that you guys help me with uh, when you watch and you tell me, oh, that's dumb or that's smart or whatever. Um, or what the perception is. Perception from outside is always different from inside. So uh, that's why I do these every day because they're so helpful both to get thoughts out of my head and into the world and also to get new fresh thoughts from you from the world back into my head. So uh, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get started with what I've already outlined as a busy day and week. Thank you so much for stopping in to check out today's vlog. If you did, you already know that if you are here regularly every day, I love you for your tenacity. Thank you so much for being here for the very reasons I just outlined. <laughs> uh, have a great Monday. I know it's Monday. Do the best you can. <laughs> Remember to do something good for yourself if you can. And I'll talk to you again next year day. Bye-bye now. Thank you.